Hi everybody, this is Josh uh, doing a Friday video. Uh, I'm outdoors, not because uh, I want to be an outdoor enthusiast or something, uh, but my kids are inside. <clears throat> and I've had my fill, my fix for the day. Uh, I can't concentrate, can't hear, and I wouldn't be able to film this inside. So I'm outside, it's beautiful. Major storm yesterday. Uh, we're in the middle of COVID quarantine. So I'm gonna give you an anxiety managing tool I use in my practice all the time. Um, so I call it a file cabinet. Uh, it's not an original idea in a sense, but it's creating a mental file cabinet, okay? So instead of letting all the ideas of the world just hang out in the same spot uh, and try to function and be happy, healthy, and present, typically that uh, doesn't work very well. We get overwhelmed and things start to clash. We get irritated. And then one more thing from our partner or our kids pushes us over the edge. So. I'm gonna to encourage to create three file cabinets. One is for all the things that need to get done today. Uh, and that, that need, I put in quotations, is subjective. So be realistic, be fair. Uh, don't make it a hundred things. Make it things that you know you really wanna get done today. If you get some extra ones, great. But don't make that list too big. The next file cabinet is soon. So anything that you wanna get done soon, in the next few days, the next few weeks, you put it in there. And the third file cabinet is future. So if there's anything going on in your head, in your heart, in your life that is bothering you that, and it's needing a lot of attention, but you don't have the time to, to address it now, put it in that future category. So there are a lot of stressors. Just got snow on my face. There are a lot of stressors uh, that come up during this time of quarantine that exacerbate pre-existing things, but we might not have the time uh, to deal with it. So I'm encouraging you to put that into your future file cabinet and say, I'm going to look at that. And maybe you schedule it. Maybe you get your calendar out right then and say, all right, May 15th, June 15th, June 1st, May 1st, whatever. Review my list, figure out if this is something I need to address, something I need to address in counseling with my partner, with my kids, coworker. Uh, but until then, you're going to leave it in that file. And every time it pops up, it's like something flies out of the file. You just go and put it back in there. Be like, nope, it's scheduled. May 1st, I'm looking at that. I don't need to worry about that right now. And then the things in the soon, same thing. Leave them in the soon. Maybe you're, and you're reviewing every day and you, maybe you're grabbing something that's moved from your soon to today file. But this structure uh, allows you to keep things in order and feel like you can be present in your day. So if you're in today and you've re reviewed your today list and you've done those, then the goal is to not just jump to all the next things on your list in, in the soon category, but is to actually be present and enjoy uh, the weather and getting outside or book, movie, puzzle, project, time with kids, time with partner, time with friends, get online. But the goal is to be freed up and feel responsible and to have some structure and order. So in review, create three file cabinets in your mind. Keep it nice and tidy versus a sloppy mess. I mean, how stressful is it to see a desk full of just papers everywhere or go to someone's home and it feels cluttered and claustrophobic and overwhelming? That can be our minds and it doesn't have to be sloppy and messy. So three file cabinets. One is today. The next one is soon. And the third is future. Those dates and times you can address, but give yourself permission to funnel ideas into those and then schedule time to review them. And then the rest of the time you can be present. So I wish you a healthy and happy day. Stay safe. Squeeze your family members. Squeeze yourself. I'll see you guys next Friday.